and write these lyrics for myself. In a wilderness, so it's kind of interesting to, to get into like the mindset of who is this character and what would they write about or what, what, what's their agenda. It's interesting to, to try to like catch a language that, that's his and try to catch a language that's like a part of this game. There is a reason why we're here. It was Piotr, maybe, who was a fan of the band. He knew Refuse and he knew my voice, and he said, oh, that's a perfect voice for, for Johnny. And that they wanted, I guess, a sound that was a bit contemporary from when it's when Johnny's supposed to have had the band, because he's sort of like an anti-establishment kind of guy. Gonna drag a corporal rat on stage, make him kneel, douse him with gas, and light him up. So of course there are things that you can relate to, and like just like this outcast and this rebel that's fighting against like the, the corporals, and that's definitely something that's been a part of my life and a part of the fuse life. We came out of the punk rock scene of uh, northern Sweden. He's like the future version of us. You know? So I, I think it makes sense. I think it totally makes sense for us to be here making these songs about him or for him. You know? So it's pretty cool. Yeah. No, 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 no trills. But yeah, but like wide vibrato. And then, I mean, just sort of feel, I mean, yeah. slowly build sort of intensity. We don't have a different mode than just going all in. So we're, we really work on these songs, trying to make them as good as possible. But then they're not actually our songs. It's interesting as, as a musician to play another musician, because that's essentially what we're doing. I mean, we're not here as refused, we're here as samurai. And I'm here with Johnny <laughs> Silverman, you know? So it's like the voice we're representing here is someone else. We'll never fade away! It's uh, been a mind fuck. I mean, the shouting in itself is just like second nature to me because I've been, I've been doing this for a very long time. But then when someone comes in and says, I'm happy with everything except for Azza Lim. Again, it's Azza. 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 Okay. I think we had it earlier, but let's do one more. Okay. The shouting's great, but think of that accent or think of that like enunciation. It's a bit weird because it is a, it's a very different way of singing when, you, when you're screaming like that and it's hard to sort of... You're swallowing some syllables there. Adjust your accent. Oh yeah, just try it again. So it's, it's been a bit uh, kind of frustrating. <laughs> it, it wasn't... It wasn't... It wasn't horrible, but it wasn't great. But I mean, I get it. I mean, we, we have to maintain the illusion that this character that's a character of the game also is, is me, like when I'm singing it. So it makes sense, but yeah, it's, it's a bit different to have someone telling you exactly how to enunciate things. Because I'm not used to, usually people are just like giving me thumbs up and then like, you know, you, you think the things like the rhythm and you think about the pitch and you think about all these things, but then someone comes in and like, that word sounded weird. I'm like, what? No, it's, it's how I sing. But so it's, it's been a very, uh, yeah, a bit painful <laughs> at times. Well, it's all right. See it is soon, I'm chipping in. Roll the bones, I'm chipping in. Bet that cone, I'm chipping in. May have clouds. It's a very interesting thing to be part of. As, as a person that's not a gamer, I don't think I fully understand the impact that this might have. 
if people like these songs and if people are excited, that, then that's going to be great. I mean, we, we are spending a lot of time trying to get this right, trying to get it to sound like, you know, like samurai would sound, you know, so it's, it's, it's quite interesting. It's a very different way of, uh, of, uh, of, of making music, actually.